Uh, not just any smoothie, of course. You're going to get options out here. Now, we're still here with netball player Shirley Otsini, as well as award-winning netball player Joe Prince in the building. They're joining us in the kitchen to share some of their tips when it comes to power and super smoothies here. Now, ooh, this is something I absolutely love. I live on, and I suggest that you get on this as well. These power smoothies contain a super food punch that can be used as a fuel ahead of a netball match, and it's something that everybody should get involved in. So, ladies in the kitchen, I know this is not the netball court, so... I don't no, well, you're going to fear, yeah, uh, but <laughs> I'm hoping for the best, yeah. What have we got here? Maybe um, I can go through your one first, Joe. What are you going to Okay, yeah, us? perfect. So, like we said, it's important to move your body, exercise, yes. get that physically fit, but it's also important what you put inside your body. Yes. So this is where the nutrition comes in. Nice. You need the power and the energy from the food to fuel you to do your exercises. Oh, I like that. So this is the power smoothie, okay. right? All right. So we have various ingredients here. We're gonna start off with the wet things. Nice. Almond milk. Very, as alternative to, yes. you know, regular milk. Alternative very healthy. Very healthy as well. Maybe great. if you're lactose intolerant, then this is a great option great for you. Great option for you. Gonna add the ice as well. And I'm actually looking at this right now, and this is almost like a, if I'm not mistaken, a vegan smoothie because we it essentially is. have everything being provided it by is. nature. Here. So nice. yeah, we have dates. Dates yes. are great nutritional. They packed with power, yes. and um, like you know, it was um, Ramadan Eid yeah. recently, so when they used to break their fast, they used they to nice. use dates to break their fast first because it is such great nutritional value. Yep, that's then we true. have the um, nice good fats in your avo, avo. Yeah, this is cup of avo. And it's also gonna give that like creaminess to it as well. Yeah, it's a nice together. little creamy mm. smoothie. Then we have spinach over here, a cup of spinach. Oh, pardon the Get mess. Get it all in there. You know, Papa didn't oh, complain oh, about this one. Oh. Get it in there. Spinach, <laughs> yes. I'm going to get it in. Okay. Good nice. job. Yeah, What? got it, got it. And a cup of bananas. Of course, you want some yes. good carbs. This is great for great your magnesium carbs. as well, right? Yes, magnesium is so good, especially also for recovery mm. after training, you know, for your muscles oh, um, yes. to get the magnesium back in and, and fill your body. And last but not least, I see you've added and in some uh, superfoods coming in some from, super from, foods. The, from our wheatgrass. This is the here. secret. Nice. This is the secret ingredient, the wheatgrass um, protein superfood powder. Look at you, Joe, come with look the look little clips out here. This. Yeah, this. Okay. This is Clearly, the this I'm is giving part you the keys. you did so well when you were playing the game. I'm and still you. doing well when you're coaching and sharing all your love and knowledge. Listen. And pretty much as simple as that, right? Is that done? Yeah, I'll give you the keys to the success, su to success, and this is the, this is it, bro. Voila. Look at this. I'm gonna. Uh, it's gonna make a noise. Button. Get ready. All right, three, two, one. Oh! <laughs> oh, and I can see the colors coming to life. That looks good. Here we go. As simple as that. All right, Joe. That. So One that is... done and dusted in the bag. You can serve it up while I oh, head sorry. over to Shirley. I see, Shirley, you've got some delicious ingredients yeah, in front of you. Yeah, These are things that you could just eat in the bowl on their own and they would taste good, right? Yeah. What are you working with there in front of you? So in front of me, I have bananas, frozen strawberries, Yum. peanut butter, yeah. plain yogurt, ice, and also um, raw oats. Oh. I have forgotten so, about the honey. Oh, I see you've got some yeah, honey there for some sweetness too. Here. All right, cool. So yeah. again, uh, we'd imagine the same thing. We kind of just get it all dumped, dumped in there, in, yeah. blend it all up and enjoy. But I must admire the ingredients that you've used here. Obviously, we've got some magnesium coming from the bananas over there. We've got some good protein, some good fats and oils coming from the peanut butter. I love the yogurt, bring it all together. And uh, again, we've got that like sweetness coming through from the strawberry. So that's like a great natural sweetener yeah. as well. Some good vitamins in that. And who can say no to honey? <laughs> a perfect yeah. natural sweetener that you can use in your smoothie. I think in anything, actually. And then I think the oats just kind of... Really, uh, well, that's going to provide you with, like, a low GI energy release. So for you people playing in these games right throughout the day, especially that tournament that's coming up, that's too, probably, uh, that's going to be perfect for yeah. you. Ladies, thank you so much. Uh, I don't think we're going to spend too much time putting this together because we know exactly how good this is going to taste just based on the ingredients. I want to ask you, um, where can people maybe get involved in this program? If they want to support you, what can they do? What do they need to do? Yeah, if anyone want to support the program and also watch some young talent in, from young kids, you can come to Kylie Chai E section, Duana Street. And if, if, if you're there, you can be there to support the kids. And if you buy the streets or passing by, you are also welcome to come and watch and support. Oh, I'm yes. sure the kids would love some support from everyone else. I mean, from everyone. 
passing. Think... Kids love audience a lot. <laughs> 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 I think Say No More is definitely behind you. And if you are in the Western Cape, then definitely get down to that event. And I must say, thank you so much again for the incredible work you're doing, Joe, for sharing your uh, experience, the, the amount of work that you've put into your sport and the fact that you're not just keeping all those nuggets to yourself, but you're sharing it with the rest of the world and with the rest of women in this country too, because I think sport is so desperate for more women heroes. And you're one of them, and I see one of them is going to become a rising star as soon as she gets the rest of the <laughs> into that. But don't stress too much about that. I must just say thank you. And, uh, what, what do you look forward to? Are you also going to be at the tournament, perhaps, by any chance? Yeah, um, you'll definitely see me at the Street Nipple um, tournaments. And because um, I think it's so important to support. Women's sport really needs the support. We need yeah. the audience. Um, and that is how we can get more opportunities, get the funds, get the sponsorships. The more eyes there are, the more funds we get. Yeah. So please, if you can, go out to any section near you and go support the Nepal, buy your World Cup tickets, watch the Telcom Nepal League happening right now, support women's sport, because it's very important for us to develop the sport and develop the young talent that we have. Yeah, like we heard Shirley say as well, she loves it when people support her. The ladies love it when they get support. So you and Zanzi, you need to get involved with this and support it too. So Shirley, how are you doing over there? Almost got all the ingredients in? No. Not yet. yet. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. No, one, no one's judging you on your kitchen skills at all because you know how good you are on the court when it comes to netball and that's where yeah. your skills are like. For now though, we'll catch up with this recipe and maybe we can try it a little bit later and see what that final taste is like. I see Joe's already digging into hers, but Zanzi, don't go anywhere. Of course, more magic will continue on your feel-good breakfast show in just a bit, and maybe we can taste some of that too. <laughs> <laughs>